This paper, Revisiting Reduction Mammoplasty by Dr. Carrie Morrison, demonstrates the complications for both symptomatic macromastia and breast conservation after breast cancer diagnosis are similar and low. Breast cancer can be surgically treated by either lumpectomy or mastectomy. Lumpectomy, which can be used in a majority of breast cancers diagnosed in the United States, can be combined with techniques of breast reduction and lift to simultaneously treat the cancer and reconstruct the remaining breast tissue, providing a single step for surgical tumor removal and optimization of aesthetic outcomes. While a great deal of research on breast reduction risk and benefit exist in the medical literature, there is little research comparing breast reduction for symptomatic macromastia, or heavy breasts, with breast reduction for treatment of breast cancer, also known as oncoplastic reduction. Without this research, surgeons can only presume that risks and complications of the procedures are the same. Dr. Morrison and her colleagues demonstrate that the risks of oncoplastic breast reduction and breast reduction for symptomatic macromastia are similar and low. A small but statistically significant risk of revision is associated with the oncoplastic reduction group. For all breast reductions, risks of complications are higher in those with obesity, smoking, and diabetes. This research shows that oncoplastic breast reduction has a similarly low risk of complications compared to reduction for symptomatic macromastia. With this information, surgeons can better counsel their patients on the benefits of this operation.